about children as economic assets brings to mind the example of epithets that distinguish children bearing the same name, either as children of the same parentage or those of brothers, cousins, and other blood relatives of the same clan living in the same communal homestead. The following examples illustrate cases where epithets are used to distinguish between such children in a communal household. For instance, if there were several males of the lineage bearing the name Kwame, differentiations will be marked by certain personal idiosyncrasies, epithets, distinctive attributes, circumstance or day of birth, place of birth, etc. You may have Kwame Nupa, meaning Kwame the eldest, Kwame Kofi, Kwame who was born on a Friday, Kwame Amadu, that is Kwame whose mother hailed from the Amadu subdivision of the Asre quarters. Kome Nubi, that is Kome, the brave, gallant son of the man. Kome Nzu, Kome given to drooling in the mouth as a child. Kome Alata, Alata being the alternate guy name for Angoni, uh, modern day Nigeria. So Kome, whose mother is from Nigeria. Similarly, names from another homestead will have for distinction Amele Pletu. Amele with the big butt. Anye bi Amele. Amele, the daughter of the matriarch of the household. Tete Blunya. Tete, one born at Christmas. And so on.